One step at a time Kachan. Bakugo laid back down on Deku's chest and both boys fell asleep. The end. Deku woke up only to find Bakugo fast asleep and snuggled up in his arms. Deku slowly removed Bakugo off him and left Bakugo's dorm room Deku's thoughts time to find Todoroki. Deku went downstairs to the common area where there sat Todoroki talking to Aitsa. Todoroki. Todoroki turned his head and saw Deku. He then dismissed himself from Aitsa and walked over to Deku. So what happened with Bakugo? That's what I have to talk to you about, can we go to my room? Sure. Both boys went to Deku's dorm room. In Deku's dorm room. So what is it? You see, Deku told Todoroki everything and what happened. I see so what you are saying is that you want to break up with me for him. I don't want that I do love you but I loved Kachin for years now and it's hard to choose. Well you are going to have to choose. And if I can't, then we are over. Give me a week sound fair. Sure. Deku had spent the whole week with Bakugo which Bakugo was very happy about. Eventually Saturday came and he then decided to talk to both of them in his room. What the hell is Icy Hot doing here? Well you see Kachan. Deku explained everything to Bakugo. Okay then who the hell are you picking me or Icy Hot? That's it I can't choose. Well if you can't choose then why don't we give you reasons on why you should choose one of us? I agree with the half and half bastard. Both Todoroki and Bakugo gave Deku reasons on which one he should choose. I just can't choose it's too hard. Well you are going to have to choose. Deku thought about it and he came to the only conclusion. Why not both of you you know all three of us. To hell with. That shit. Pissed off faces. Yeah I mean me and Bakugo can't get along. B but this is the best solution think about it you will both be able to have me and I will be able to have both of you don't you think this is a great plan. Both Todoroki and Bakugo thought about it. Tisk. I guess. Really. Very glad that both Bakugo and Todoroki are willing to do this face. Yeah sure. I hate doing this shit. All three of them made rules between their new relationship. Rules. Each one of them will have Deku for a whole week and then switch. Neither Bakugo or Todoroki will talk to each other. And finally but not least. Whatever happens stays between themselves and Deku. The whole class slowly started to suspect what was happening between all three of them and the first one to say anything was of course. Mina. In the common area. Are you, Bakugo, and Todoroki in a relationship? Mina asked Deku. Hee hee. Is it that noticeable? It took us some time but we caught on. You guys don't find it weird or you know, disgusting. Everyone shook their heads no if you guys are like that then we won't judge it really isn't our place. Deku smiled and started to cry happy tears. You guys are the best. Emotional happy tears. Hell yeah we are. Kiri's Hima doing his super supportive and very manly arm. And so that's how Todobaku Deku was. Born. The end.